Pat Short. Pat Short. Oh, hey. Thank you very much. Hi, yeah, yeah. Sure. Great, great to see you as always, Pat. Uh, listen, I, 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 you, you could have got me a chair, couldn't you? Well, yeah, no. <laughs> oh, I mean, hang on a second. We're, we're not that glad to see you. <laughs> yeah, we're trying to scab a free performance out here. <laughs> and it's yeah. kind of warm in here. We just Jesus. thought we'd go, yeah. we'd go with the whole stand-up thing. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> and just, and of course. Oh, geez, yeah. I missed that. I, I didn't see that coming. <laughs> uh, so how have you been? Like We haven't Good. seen you for a while now. You yeah. were, I think it was... You've toured the show Hey before. I was in town about it last year. And and this is this is the end of the tour now. Yeah, yeah. the last kind of leg of it and we're on on in the Olympia Theatre in in a few weeks time so and that's the last run of it in Dublin so it's great it's it's going great we're flying it all over the country I was down in May over the weekend and oh sorry about that (laughs) (laughs) sorry about that there's a few people still down there you know it's the end of the the tour doing gigs in May it's like when you see the walk and at the end of the Olympics yeah yeah (laughs) All of the board and stuff is coming. No, the Mayo crowd, lovely crowd. The Mayo crowd. Yeah, I may, I may have to go back. I mean, lovely yeah. crowd. Yeah, yeah, you're nice about the me, Pat. So listen, it's nothing Mayo before you, footballs. With all of that going on, then did you get a bit of Christmas going on? I did, did you, yeah, did you do yeah. it properly? Like, did you go for it? Yeah. Well, you see, I kind of. It, it's funny. Our tour starts. The big tour starts in January, uh, straight after Christmas, and it runs right through up till the summer kind of thing. So uh, pre Christmas, then you're just kind of running around doing television stuff and everything else. Even the papers writing about it the other day. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, that was yeah, great. That was oh, this is you being the top late late oh, joke. Yeah. Oh, yeah. um, talk about a story. You're honest, yeah. as, you're honest as much as Ryan. Well, apparently, yeah. well, apparently they got oh, confused oh, that Ryan Tupperty was the actual host. Was not, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was very funny, though, it being there. And they put the people who have been on the late late show the most. The most, yeah. Me, well me, and, me, I was the top with, uh, what's his name? Um, uh, the, the, Dermot Bannon. Dermot Bannon. Bannon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Which that was over a four year period. <laughs> yeah, no. which means I was twice on one year and uh, <laughs> once on another year. So. Yeah, yeah, but it's gas, though, isn't it's it? It's funny, but, funny how they make a story out of something. Yeah, but it's good. But it's great. It's great to be seen there. I'm delighted. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we do end up doing a lot of television stuff before Christmas. Probably seen that. But then I take time off over Christmas, and then the tour starts. But now it's just flat. Are out you are you a Christmas fan? Oh, I love it. Yeah, oh, right. Okay, so you were I delighted do, yeah. to get stuck into it. Well, I, it's uh, Blue Monday yesterday. Now I always think people like you are responsible for that. <laughs> What's Blue Monday? Depression. Oh, Blue Monday. Do you know yeah. Blue Monday. No, no. So Blue Monday. The third Monday. Monday in January every year, right? Yeah, it's when yeah. people are at their most uh, depressed. Depressed because yeah. they haven't been paid oh. for weeks and yeah, there'll yeah. be another couple of weeks for comes. <laughs> uh, and PJ like, blames I mean, Christmas for this. With your NAR game, you get well used to not getting paid for things yeah, and waiting know, and yeah. hanging around. But, so. but yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> You'd be depressed the fact all that it's like you know it's dark it's cold it's yeah. the middle of the winter and uh, all of that and I personally now I don't mean this to be an attack in an interview but yeah. I blame the likes of you now <laughs> <laughs> who, who you like Christmas, you Christmas, you Christmas you I'm, fuck, yeah. I'm too depressed I, I'm too busy to be depressed and all that kind of thing so people should get out and get a bit busier yeah, well, that's, that's the secret. <laughs> Actually, speaking of being busy, um, the tour obviously is 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 what you're in for to chat to us about. But yeah. we should mention the podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the, yeah. everybody's doing a podcast? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's what are you doing? Well, it's no, I just like everybody is doing a podcast. It's kind of a, I, I, I always loved that the medium of radio and podcast is kind of in that genre. Mm. So it, it's kind of you do it yourself. So I've in, I'm doing a sketch show. It's all different characters uh, that I have. Uh, it's called the, the mindfulness and well-being hour with pair that's me <laughs> is that what it is yeah called? yeah and the beauty of it is it's only 18 minutes long so you're 42 minutes to yourself <laughs> <laughs> just chill and that, that that for me is wellness. You know, you time on your oh, own with yourself. You know me? And I have loads of characters coming in that, like I have, I have a Dr. Finton O'Brien from uh, Kerry North in E, and he thinks people should be doing more procedures on themselves. And because they think, so he, <laughs> because, it'll, you know, there's lots of things that people are in the hospital for, blocking up A&E and that, when they could yeah. seriously be doing them on themselves. So he's, <laughs> he's he, he, yeah, yeah. He has loads of, he's like, you know, first thing a doctor do is, is uh, his idea would be like, the first thing to do is no more panaria that you're going to do a little procedure on. So if you ever got a slap of a hurley when you were young fella, you feel nothing for about <laughs> half an hour. So he beats the shit of himself with a hurley in the area he's going to do the incision. And then of course it costs him nothing. <laughs> Fantastic. So he's got loads of lovely tips. I have a lovely fella, Eugene Malumbly, mindfulness and well-being. And Eugene is a great character that... Um, <laughs> <laughs> you nearly have to hear Eugene, uh, you know, because uh, he, he's, he's a great character. He's went through a lot in his life. We get out to his little cottage in rural Ireland to interview him and talk to him. But he has lovely nuggets and things. He's come from a very dark place. And now he's kind of going to enlighten the rest of us with things. And when we get to the house, he won't come out of there because he's after going to a dark place again. <laughs> <laughs> and he, we hear him kicking the shit out of the place inside the record. So there's all so, these kind of things. So have you got a lot of these already in the bag? I have this some in the bag and I'm, I'm working with... Um, 
I'm working with a gang in the, in the college in Limerick, uh, Limerick Art College down there, and in the sound and film department. I and mean, we're kind of building up libraries of Foley and all this kind of stuff. So we create characters and sketches. I go into the studio with them for a couple of days a week, and we'll just go mad. And Brilliant. Have a crack in there with a team of students. And, That's and the great Camille podcast, though, isn't yeah. it? Your freedom to just go in and have a go. Well, this is it, yeah. And I, I like to kind of push things out a little bit in the sense of having a good crack at the unpc-ness of things and all the rest. And yeah. That's the other thing I like about the podcast. You, there's no restrictions. And I assume with yeah, exactly, yeah. podcast. Yeah. I report Anywhere. you to the BIA. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. 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 See where that gets you. Yeah. <laughs> You're caught out of it, exactly. <laughs> so I assume it's, and like with most podcasts, you can get it pretty much anywhere. Uh, wherever well, wherever it, anybody yeah. gets We're, we're launching on it on the 4th of February. Right. Um, and it's great because it's coinciding with the strike in the school. So anyone on the picket can be listening to it <laughs> outside the schools. And the students won't be at school, so they'll be able to listen to it all day long. Cause play it on a, <laughs> so it's a win-win. So it's a win-win for everyone, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, what's the dates then of Hey Hey is back hey, in the Olympia so on the, the actually, final I have, run I have them here oh, yeah. actually uh, it's uh, so 30th, 30th 31st 1st and 2nd of February so 30th 31st For- of Jan 1st, 2nd oh, of Jan. No, just the 1st of Feb, I think, is, is the Saturday night. Is that right? Oh, is it? James Sorry, is you're right. James, James you're is right. there not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's, there's a man <laughs> in the corner. <laughs> <right now. laughs> the three of us are trying to figure it out. There's a man in the corner knows, knows the answer. Yeah, he knows everything. He won't talk. I was trying to get you an extra gig out that day now. Come on, tell us. Right, sir. The man in the corner. We're on the podcast. is January 1st of February. That's it. Yeah. Uh, ticket master, of course, if you want to get your hands on tickets. Uh, Brilliant uh, stuff. Just so you're, you'll be mad busy again. Yeah. And of course, in fairness, you've only been with us uh, about a dozen times. That's so you're due. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so yeah. I mean, I'm up, we have to start there. challenging the late lady. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. we'll have to start, yeah, start fighting Ryan to get you in more often. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, thanks a million for coming Thank in. you very much. Great to see you. Can't wait to see the show. <laughs>